Elvis fans now have a chance to own the King's one-time home. The house was located in East Tupelo, Mississippi, for almost a century before being meticulously dismantled in 2017 and preserved for eventual reassembly at a location of the auction winner's choice. A press release from Rockhurst Auctions, which will host the sale, says the opportunity to buy the house is an incredibly special and nearly unprecedented opportunity in the collecting world. Built in the late 1920s by Noah Presley, the uncle of Vernon Presley for his middle son, Iac, the humble home was marked by its cobalt blue planks and white framed windows. The house sat just around the corner from the home where the King of Rock and Roll was born, but he lived at 1241 Kelly Street with his parents from 1933 to 1944. Though the Presleys moved around quite a bit and inhabited a few different houses in East Tupelo before it was annexed to be part of Tupelo in 1946, this house is the only childhood home of Elvis that has ever been put up for auction, according to Rockhurst. During the house's disassembly, which was done under the supervision of Elvis experts Chris Davidson and Stephen Schutz, the crew noted key features of the house that were discovered as they peeled away the home's layers. All the elements of the house are currently stored in a 30-foot American Holler Nighthawk trailer, which the auction winner will also get to keep. Included with the purchase of the house is an hour-long documentary of the dismantling process. Stories from lifelong Tupelo resident, local police officer and Elvis birthplace historian Guy Harris, who grew up just a few houses away from the legend, are also included in the footage. An eight-minute-long clip of the footage was posted on YouTube by Jeff Marin of Rockhurst Auctions.